You know, Sia, there's a way in which you said beautiful, beautiful lady that made me think, hey, this guy, is he trying to get some numbers? What's going on here? Hey, motives. But anyway, I'm sure that there was little doubt in Jodie's parents' mind when she picked up a mic at the age of, well, actually a, a hairbrush at the age of nine years old and started singing that she was destined for stardom. And it was no surprise as well when her debut album came out, it was platinum selling with three singles that were on the top of the charts. And she's right here right now telling us all about that. Jodie, how are you? I'm well, thanks. Very, very yeah. good to meet you. I think we've actually met before, but you don't remember. Yeah. Because back in the... You know what Sorry. I'm saying? It's like, who's that guy? Who's oh, that guy? You know, how, you know how they know again, these people, these people. But very good to have you here. Thanks. And uh, we, we were just talking about, you know, how you grew up and before you started, be, you know, becoming a star like you are. Um, in high school, you say you were, you were kind of the quiet girl. I was. I was very quiet. I was sort of in the middle. You sort of spoke to everyone friendly. <laughs> really? Yeah. I, I find that hard to believe. Me too. I was what? actually reading here. They say here, as a baby, Jodie was always pleasant and never grumpy. Mm -hmm. Unlike other normal toddlers, she would never go to strangers and uh, she was very attached to her parents as a comfort. Yeah, so that's you never, actually true. <laughs> you you yeah. never had one of those in the shops. Nah, I want that. that no, that, my mom will give me one smack. <laughs> it's like pull yourself together. <laughs> But indeed, I mean, life, life has been going, you know, very well for you. your career. It took off, you know, as yeah. best as it, as it could have taken off. I mean, what, what do you think about that? Yeah, well, for, well, especially at my age, I think it's a big achievement, you know, seeing that I'm, I'm also one of the youngest artists, you know, in the industry. So seeing where I came from, where I am now and my future type of thing, it's, you know, it's, I've learned a lot in the industry, so. Yeah, but yeah. I think one thing I want to know is, yeah. is when you won that competition, right? And, you know, overnight, the next day, you were famous. There were yeah, prizes. Literally. There was a car. <laughs> there was this, and it was just all there. Yeah. How did you absorb that and still be able to remain the person you are? Because I mean, you you you're a nice girl. You're Very humble. humble. Yeah. Thanks. Um, I don't know. It's just like I didn't actually think of it in that way. I was like, oh my gosh, I won the competition, and now I got to do these shows and all that, and I was more excited than you know. I didn't think of this. Yeah. Like you know, it just I don't know. I'm just not that person. <laughs> I'm still normal. <laughs> And I'm sure that you have, yeah, you have a question for her. Yeah, Jodie, it is Youth Day, and yeah. we are celebrating the young people in 1976. Um, as a young pioneer now for Love Life as well, what does Youth Day mean to you? Um, well, I think it's, you know, to appreciate the youth of the past and the present and the future, you know, to enjoy the freedom that we have today. That's so, very interesting you're mentioning yeah. the past, the present and the future, yeah. which is what the pioneering of Naganjan is all about, yeah. which I really like. And yeah. as young people, we should know that we should not only look at the past, but look at going forward and celebrating yeah. our current struggles mm -hmm. and overcoming them. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm sure there's, there's many young people that look up to you and, and they uh, want to yeah. be future Jodies one day. What, what, oh, what? sweet. <laughs> yes. Wow. See, I'm getting ahead of you there. <laughs> what, what message would you have for them? Um, you know, take every opportunity that you get, you know, and don't be scared to take a risk, you know, life is about chances, your whole life is basically a risk, I mean, I took the chance in, you know, entering, you know, the competition and, I mean, what are the chances of me, you know, one in a million, literally, you know, for me winning the competition and, you know, yeah, I am today. That's true, the youngest so, winner of that competition. Yeah. And hard work, stuff. hard work. Yeah. And stay in school. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. But tell me, what, what have you been up to? Because, I mean, since then, you've been reasonably quiet. The singles were there. The album did very well. What have you been busy with since then? Um, since the competition, I've been, you know, doing lots of shows, you know, countrywide. I'm still busy with, you know, a few. Um, yeah, um, I don't know. Come on, let it I, I, I've, I've <laughs> got, got a feeling she's trying to hide something. Yeah, yeah. What are you hiding? Um, I've, I've just recently come back from Singapore. Well, not recently, well, a few months ago. So, yeah, I performed at the YOG where I was um, chosen to represent Africa to sing. I know, I know. Never mind the country, the continent. So, we were there to do the theme song for the actual event and we got the opportunity to perform it live on the actual show. And I met Sean Kingston as well. I have to put that in there. You met Sean Kingston? Yes. Oh, was that when you were you flustered? Were you, yeah, Sean Kingston. I wasn't sure and then I just sat there. I was like, okay, he's walking past. Do I greet him now or what do I do? So I just sat there and he came to come say hello. I was like, hi. <laughs> yeah. That is so cool. Well, thank you very much for being with us. There's going to be lots more from Jodie a bit later on. She's going to be singing for us, you know, Kiss so nice. Yeah. <laughs> I love that song. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It. I love that song. <laughs> but anyway, so uh, right now, uh, we've got USN competition for you where you could win amazing, an amazing prize, hamper with 5,000 Rand. Wow. Sure. You could pick anything you anything. want. That's quite amazing. Check this out.